In this video, we're gonna cover step-by-step -step how you can record the screen of your Windows PC for YouTube or for tutorial videos. Hey, it's Justin Brown here from Primal Video. We release a ton of content to help you get better results with your videos faster. If you're new here, then make sure you click that big subscribe button and all the links to everything that we mentioned in this video, you can find linked in the description below. So let's jump into it. Now, screen captures are a great way to really step your audience through a process on screen, teach them how to use an app or software, record presentations with slides, or even capture B-roll of products or websites for your videos. In fact, screen captures are one of the easiest ways to create B-roll, so if you're not using them, then you definitely should be. In this video, we'll be covering exactly how you can capture your screen on a Windows PC with a range of options, both free and paid. The paid options do have some advantages, so we'll cover our pick first, and then follow up with a run-through of the best free options that we've found to get you started. So in regards to the paid options for screen capture on Windows, there's really four solid options. The first one is WeVideo. Now WeVideo has plans for $4.99 and $7.99 per month, but what it lets you do is it runs the whole process. The whole application is run through your web browser. So there's no need to download and install any software. It also means that you can use this on low-end computers, things like Chromebooks as well. So when you're screen capturing in Wii Video, you get the option to either record your entire screen or draw out a section of your screen. Now, that's pretty common with most screen capture software. Where Wii Video really stands out is that it's an online cloud-based editing solution. So because it's all run through your browser, it makes it really easy to collaborate on your video editing with other team members or other people anywhere in the world. We have done a video on Wii Video and I'll link it up in the cards now, so make sure you check it out. But Wii Video is a solid option for screen capturing because once you've done the screen capture, you've then got Wii Video as the editor to be able to edit that down and to really add a heap of effects and titles and things to it to make your screen captures look really good. But also the fact that it is an online cloud-based editing platform, meaning that you can get other team members from anywhere around the world to help you edit that down. Option number two for screen capture on Windows is Bandicam. Now this is one that's come through pretty high rated and there's some pretty cool features in here as well. This one is a popular one with gamers. It's got a heap of screen recording features specifically for gaming, like bringing up your frames per second on screen, allowing you to have a picture in picture from your webcam so that you can have yourself on screen while you're recording your game or, or recording your screen. So there's some pretty cool features like that in there. There is a free version of this available as well, but the screen recording is limited to 10 minutes and it has a watermark on it. So $39 is the one that we're talking about here. No watermark, unlimited record time. You've got some pretty cool features like, as I just said, being able to record your webcam and bring it in as a picture in picture. So you can show both on screen. You can also do annotations and draw out things on your screen recording at the time of recording. So there's no post production in Bandicam, meaning that it's not editing software. So once you finish your recording, you're left with a video file. So anything that you do, all the tools for annotations and things are there for while you're recording live. Once you're done, you, if you want to make any further changes, you will need video editing software. Option number three is Snagit. Now, Snagit is an awesome screen capturing and screen recording tool, not just for video, but for still images of your screens. It's got some really cool features in there, and it's actually probably one of the leaders when it comes to screen capturing on Windows. Now, just like Bandicam, you do have the ability to record your webcam as well simultaneously so that you can do some basic editing and switch between your webcam and your screen recording while you're creating these videos. There is some really basic editing built in to Snagit, more so around the annotations and arrows and text and things that you can overlay on your videos to help your viewers follow along with what it is you're showing them. Now, if you are looking to edit your screen recordings down after capturing them, then you're probably better off looking at either standalone video editing software or look at Snagit's big brother, which is our option number four, Camtasia. Now Camtasia is a big step up price-wise from Snagit. Now, Snagit was $49.95 US, Camtasia sells for $199 US. But both Snagit and Camtasia are cross-platform, meaning that you can install them on both Mac and Windows. And if you're working with different people or across different computers, you can share your projects and they'll both open and work the same on both. But where Camtasia really stands out is it is a complete end-to-end -end solution on Windows for screen recording and editing. So not just annotations, it's also 
actually editing the video files down, editing your webcam footage in with your screen captures and having the ability to bring one up full screen, move it around to do a picture in picture effect, to really add titles and create professional videos. Camtasia is really the go-to end-to-end solution for a lot of businesses out there for creating professional screen captures and professional videos. Now in regards to the actual screen recording, if you're comparing Snagit to Camtasia, there is a lot of similarities. I mean, essentially one's just a cut down version of the other. But really the main differences come in when you're looking at simultaneously recording your webcam or external microphones and external audio as well. That's where Camtasia is the much more professional solution. If I'm looking for one program that does everything and I don't need to export and re-import into different programs and do other editing there, Camtasia is really the no-brainer here. And at that $199 price point, it is actually a very solid video editing application regardless of the screen capture or not. It does have color correction. It does have motion graphics and motion titles. It's a solid solution for $199 and that would be my pick. So those are the paid options. Now let's take a look at a free option. Now you can also get really good results in this option, but you won't have any editing capability. So if you're already using other editing software to edit your videos, then that's not gonna be a deal breaker for you. So in my opinion, the best free screen recording software you can get on Windows is OBS Studio, and it is 100% free. Now typically OBS or open broadcast software is live streaming software, but it also has screen recording capabilities built in. It's also a really popular option for screen recording on Windows because it really doesn't put your computer system under a heap of load. So it's a low CPU and low GPU usage while you're recording. So a lot of people use it for recording games. A lot of people use it for recording their live streams as well, but it's definitely not the easiest program out there to use. You will get a heap of options and advanced options around the different uh, sizes, resolutions, bit rates, and codecs that you can do your screen recordings in. And it will let you either draw out a section of your screen or record the full screen. And it will also let you bring in webcams and position your webcam as a picture in picture as well. But once again, you won't get that control afterwards in your editing to resize that webcam. It's all baked in. Whatever you're recording at the time of recording is what your end file is going to be. So in summary, there are four paid solutions that are worth considering. The first is WeVideo, which is a cheap option that will allow you to store your screen recordings and edit them collaboratively with other team members. You've got Bandicam, which is a bit more expensive, but gives you a heap more options around your screen recordings. You've then got Snagit, which is just a little bit more again at $49.99, which gives you a whole suite of tools for your screen recording and for your screen capturing, but it still doesn't have all your full editing capabilities. Or you've got the complete end-to-end -end solution Camtasia at $199. And you've also then got the free option of OBS Studio, which once again has no editing capabilities built in. So what's my recommendation for you? Well, what I'd suggest is that you grab the trial versions and give each of these a go and see which one works best for you, for your workflow, and for the types of videos you're going to be creating. The only real complete end-to-end -end solution here is Camtasia. So if you're looking for one application to do all your screen recording and all your editing, start to finish, then it's a no-brainer. Camtasia is the software for you. If you've already got editing software, then that's where you could look at Snagit. You could also look at Bandicam. You could also look at OBS as well. Or if you're looking to edit your videos collaboratively and edit them remotely and with team members anywhere in the world, then WeVideo will be the one for you. Now, if you're shooting video with your iPhone or your Android smartphone, then we've put together a video that runs through the step-by-step -step process that will make a huge difference in your results fast. Check out the two videos linked on screen now, and I'll see you soon.